as a beginner how do you edit your videos so in this video i'm going to be taking you step by step on how to edit your video using cap cuts. yes i'm going to start with cap cuts, and then every other video that comes up you're going to see other um me trying other apps to show you how to edit your video so if this is what you'd love to watch consider watching this video to the end and don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you like it also don't forget to you know drop a comment share the video and subscribe if you are yet to so yeah let us dive into the video hi guys welcome to at least there is where fate fun and formation unite so first you want to go to your app store to download CapCut on it if you don't have CapCut on your phone and now bear in mind that you need your data like you need to access this app using your data it's it has a free version okay if you are not subscribed to the pro version you can still use this app to edit your video but you must have your data on for you to access every other features and you know once you've unlocked other features using your data you can also access them offline so guys this is the cap cut i already have it on my phone if you don't have it remember go to play store download it there so when you tap on it you can see my currently my data is not on but this is what the interface of the app is looking like so if you want to my okay my project have appeared the ones i've been doing before and then so if you want to create a new project let's let's um, explore the interface first so this is me that's me remember no internet connection so that's why i said that if you want to access it your data has to be on so i'm going to on my data now so now the data is on so you can see view history help center and the rest CapCut Pro so if you want to join the CapCut Pro so that you'll be able to access all the features on the app you join it but I'm not joining it then this is library library is where you have your projects the space you have left local media and then every other thing like the favorites trash brand keys share for review and all of that so next is the the main part we need here is the edit slip part where you have your new project so if you want to edit you tap on new project then you pick any i'm gonna pick this no i'm gonna pick this one i just yeah i'm gonna pick this so now this is where you, this is the importing of your video if you want to import video if you want to import photos you import it so this one is from my album so you can see so i've already picked the one i want and then that this is media the other feature here is test if you want to write test and or to voice over it that's tone test to speech you explore that as well but we are what we are doing is the video editing so then you add it you need to export it to the app so now you see this this is what we have let me explore the features for you guys first so this is edit this is the edit part you can see the edits where you have different we have the split speed animation effect delete enhance voice eye contact which is free isolate voice remove background retouch camera tracking volume transform under the transform you can see we have rotate you want to rotate it mirror so this is mirror and then resize if you want to resize it so let's go back so that's for the transform then we have auto frame auto reframe is a pro version of the app then we have adjust we have video quality we have filters we have relight also a pro version 
we have overlay we have basic we have max duplicate replace extract audio motion blur stabilize opacity reverse freeze audio effect reduce noise beats and on link so this is for the edit part then here we have the audio you can see audio we have sounds brand music copyright sound effects text to audio extract and record this record is for the voiceover then the next one we have is text so under text we have add text that's when you want to add your text the stickers auto captions text to audio text template auto lyrics and draw so this that's for the test then we have overlay if you want to overlay another video to this or a picture then we have um, effects you can see we have video effect we have body effect we have photo effects then here we have captions so you can auto generate the caption then look at this the caption enter caption if you want to enter the caption yourself auto caption caption templates auto lyrics import captions then we have aspect ratio we have filters you can see we have different filters we have presets we have um, filters we have adjust and video quality I'm going to come back into detail for all this one but i just want to show you the basic features that we have in this app so you see the filters this is adjust adjust is where you have the color match color correction brightness contrast saturation brilliance sharpen clarity hsl graphs color wheel highlight shadows white blacks temperature hue fade vignette green so anyone you explore this is the video quality here you have your image quality reduce image noise optical flow remove flickers so these are the options we have i'm going to um, explain every features later on but this is just the basic pictures for you to see that this particular app that's CapCut app has then so that's it for filter and adjust then we have stickers and we have background so these are the pictures we have in this app then you see this part here is the video quality as well where you have the resolution the frame rate the optical flow code rate so you can see this is the recommended one because of the storage of the phone and especially when if this is how the setting was when you were recording your video you cannot increase it because it's going to affect the functioning of the video so this is the recommended one because this is how i record it from the camera of my video then the re resolution as well you can increase it if you want to increase it but it's going to take up a lot of space so then this part is the export where you export your video when you are done with all your editing and everything so let me um let me go back to this one so this is the timeline where you get to adjust and you know explore your video so let me do a quick just say a little editing for this particular one too so that it won't be that it's just the features i showed you guys so you see this part here if you want to split the video this is what you call split this is what this is what happens when you split it it cuts it into different parts you can see you can see this is 5.4 seconds and this is 1.16 um, minutes so you can see that's for the cut that's the cut then this is speed this is speed this is normal if you want to increase it times two that's the normal speed to increase it but if you want to use the let me tap on this one speed again if you want to use curve method 
where it's going to your data has to be on for that so you choose whichever one you can see for this montage here yeah, it's going to start with the normal this thing there is it's going to increase like it's going to be fast then it will be slow like that you can see the range of it you can see so you see it's fast slow and everything like that or if it's this one this is how you want it so it just any way you want to you can see the way it's doing so anyone you want that's for the speed so you can see then let's go to the filter for the filter but filter you choose anyone you want but this is the major one you need adjusting so let's come for the brightness brightness so you increase the brightness you can see the initial one but mostly i increase the brightness to let's say 20 20 is okay then the contrast let's see contrast should be 8 saturation should be let's see it depends on you well i'll put it let's let's try 10 i think 10 is okay then sharpen that's five so i think this is highlight okay we need highlight as well highlight should be 10 as well so you can see how the the this thing is looking like now let's see the difference you can see the difference with of this one from this one that there is no edit you can see the difference so let me play it so you see this is the initial one without the editing and this is the one with the editing that's adjusting and everything so what do you think about this so in other videos i'm going to be exploring other features for you guys if you find this video helpful don't forget to give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you're here to and share the video to anyone that will be interested in content like this if you have any question for me leave it in the comment section and i'll definitely respond to your comments thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next video where we're going to be exploring other features in this app see you guys in my next video bye stay blessed